When the first Ming Emperor, Chu Yu Chan, died, his throne passed on to his grandson, Chu Yung Wen, also known as Emperor Chen Wen. But after being on the throne for four years, he started listening to some bad advice, and he harassed the good people. As a result, another grandson, later known as Emperor Yen, moved against him, and Chen Wen disappeared. So Yen sent out his chief marshal, the eunuch Chen Ho, to the west, searching for Emperor Chen Wen. This episode of Chinese history has been well documented as one of the first times Chinese culture was encountered by neighboring countries. These peoples learned to respect China and built temples to Chan Ho's memory, many of which are still standing all around Southeast Asia, even today. Majesty, I'm sorry to have caused you this trouble. That is all right. You have done your duty well. Get up. Get up. 
Thank you, Your Majesty. It is clear the assassin is a loyalist to the memory of Emperor Chen Wen. But this makes me feel unhappy. I was attacked in Nanking too. They seem to think I want to sit upon the throne. Whereas this just isn't the case. <sighs> if I could find Emperor Chen Wen, I would explain everything. From what I know, Emperor Chen Wen was protected by his bodyguards, Young and Ye, and probably they've taken him away, and he's staying in the West. Oh? Can you be so sure that is where he is gone? Hmm. Chen Ho? Yes, sir. How did you get to learn of the assassination attempt? Your Majesty, during the parade, this girl dared to block your way. She might have been killed immediately, but she was able to get through the guards. She proved herself a skillful fighter. Her Kung Fu was really excellent, so I feel your life is still in danger. Good. Good. You're most astute and intelligent. I'm confident you're the one to conduct the mission to the West. <laughs> Master? Are you angry? They have failed me. We have missed our opportunity to kill the Emperor. It's a pity. A real pity. Oh, there's no need to upset yourself so. Master, there will always be another time. What do you know? Hmm? It's the first time. The Emperor's been out since he came to power. Three years ago. But you're usually so calm. Why should you be so overwrought by what has happened? I missed my chance. They mucked it up. Now I have to think of another way to get the throne. Right, but I'm confident you will get the throne. <laughs> You'll be a good king. <laughs> and when I do become king, you will be my queen. Get up. Thank you, Majesty. <laughs> Signed up. What? What's this? Uh, I am Tai Zhou. I can't write, but I've always wanted to become a soldier. Huh. I think you better go home. Ah, uh, Captain. But I'm a very good cook. I've many years' experience. I can cook dishes for you, special ones too. Right? You'll be cook. Put him on the payroll. <laughs> Tan Ying, I'm 23. I'm a good soldier, Captain. Oh, is that so? You certainly have a big mouth, don't you? You don't look to be much use to me. Captain? 
Come on. You have to sign me on. I'll be general. Huh? Uh. A general? You look to me to be a weakling. Not even strong enough to hold a sword. <laughs> Don't judge people just on appearances. Do you really think you look like a general? You watch your talk. Get out of here, or I'll see you get punished. Ah? Uh, are generals usually so overbearing and rude? You really are asking for trouble, aren't you? Haven't I told you already? I'm going to be a general. Huh. You'll never be general. <laughs> huh? You believe me. I'm telling the truth. Well. The chief marshal is looking for good men. I think I qualify. My kung fu is good. If you think you're really that good, then why don't we test you out first? Right. You are witnesses. If I should lose, punish me as you like. But if I should win, then I'll have to be considered fair enough. All right. What weapons do you choose? Anything that you want. Oh. <laughs> That's easy. Arm wrestling. I've won. Uh, you've tricked me. That was unfair. Soldiers keep their word. General, I've beaten you. You must keep your promise. You, you were beaten. General, a good soldier always keeps his promises. Marshal, he... I've always preferred men who combine intelligence and strength. Marshal, you won't recruit him. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Chief Marshal. <laughs> Master, are you still unhappy? Of course not. I'm happy now. Why are you so happy? What's the matter with you? Emperor Yen has ordered the Chief Marshal to go west, so now's my chance. He is recruiting for soldiers. And soon, he will be on his way. I still don't understand why you're happy. You don't understand what's going on. Chen Ho has been ordered to go west to kill Emperor Chen Wen. That's the real reason he's going. But the west is my area. I know those people, and I can control them. I'll find Emperor Chen Wen. <laughs> and kill them. Kill all of them? Right. Chen Ho's good at Kung Fu. Unbeatable. Only I'm able to defeat him. I'll show Emperor Yen who is boss. Oh, Master, if you go to the West, how about me? You, dear, have to stay here. Master, I won't stay here. I want to go with you. That's right. Master, we don't want to stay here. We'll go with you to the West. Master, Master we Master, all want to go with you. Master. Master. All right. You better get ready. Oh, oh thank, oh, you, thank you, you, Master. Thank, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Master, you... 
you killed them all? <laughs> Master, I'll listen to you. I'll stay if you like. I'd like you to go too. Really, but not the West. To your death. <gasps> Master, you. <laughs> you go, coat. You can't be hit. <gasps> Died for love. General, why don't you go to bed at night? What are you doing here? Oh, I was going to ask you the same question. Why are you here? I'm worried about the Marshal. I'm worried for his safety. That's why I came to patrol. Oh, everyone knows that I'm the Marshal's bodyguard. I think you've something else on your mind. You... <laughs> Marshal. Marshal. Now, General, what are you arguing about when it's so late? I came to protect you, Marshal, and I met General Ma. Marshal, let me explain. That's enough. You've had a long day. Tang Ying, you'd better clean up your face. Marshal. If you're worried about me, I've chosen the right man. You get some rest now. Yes. We'll reach Anam tomorrow. Anna, how dare these wretched little Chinese threaten me? <laughs> oh, Your Majesty, I have an idea. Uh. What is it? Marshal and his fleet has come to Anam, we should extend you a welcome. We used to be on such friendly terms, but now you visit my country with a fleet of boats. Anam is ready to surrender, so we asked the Marshal to send a deputation of officers to hold a meeting with us at the harbour. Chief Marshal, it appears they know your reputation. 
the Empress says that he is willing to surrender to you. What do you think, General Ma? Uh, I don't trust them. I think they're deliberately setting a trap for you. I'm sure this is a trick of theirs. Give my answer. I will go alone to meet the Emperor. Sup? Now come here. Huh? Marshal! Hmm? Do what I've said. Yes. Marshal, Tan Ying is acting suspiciously. I don't trust him. If we send him on a secret mission, I'm afraid he might foul up. He could give us trouble. General, we must learn to trust each other. Don't be so rude. Yes, sir, but he's... You talk far too much about other people. Our Emperor has ordered me to bring you gifts, jewelry. We will protect you. Our country is very powerful. If I kill Chen Hao, you have nothing more to worry about. <laughs> the face. Thank you. He's very shrewd. He's not an ordinary man. <laughs> It doesn't matter how great he is, as this time, he won't get away from me. Oh, then you cannot be a human. What's that? You dare insult me? Oh, we have an old saying. When you're not human, it means you must be like one of the gods. That's what I'm saying. Huh. I'm not human. I'm not human! <laughs> this! arriving here soon. You had better hide now. Do as you're told. Turn up! <laughs> oh, and now please permit me to give your majesty a gift. <laughs> it's the most valuable thing we can give, so please accept it. <laughs> Take it! What's that? Oh, but it's a most respectable gift. This is no ordinary toad. It's a king toad. It means we hold you in high regard. Oh! <laughs> We're represented by the elephant, and you give us the king of toads. This means that Anam holds all other countries under its sway and is revered as number one. <laughs> Cheers! <laughs> A toad usually likes eating worms. You may think that you are the best. In fact, you are nothing. <laughs> What's that? But you say I'm not a human, now you say I'm a toad. What do you think you're doing? And who the hell are you? <laughs> I'm one of Marshal Chan's men. I'm Commander Tang Ying. <laughs> 
Chen Ho or not? You better talk. I am Chief Marshal Chen Ho and coming here to see you as agreed. Uh, so you are the real Chief Marshal. You're not so smart as we thought. You've fallen into our trap. You better surrender quietly. Uh, man, tie him up. Uh, you want to fight back? Let him uh, go. General, I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, Your Majesty, forgive me, please. Please forgive me, please. Stupid fool. You made me lose considerable face. I should never have listened to you. Chan Ho to see Your Majesty. Oh, oh, oh. You're really an intelligent man. And so, I am willing to pay homage to you. Your Majesty. General? Huh? You've done well. You performed excellently. Huh. Hey, tonight, the Marshal has given us leave to go out. What are you going to do for amusement, huh? I'm not interested in such things. Leave me out of it. <laughs> Oh, that's oh, better. Oh, 
I've needed this all day. Hey, water over here. Hey, anybody got a towel? I'll be here, Carl. Give me some salt, will you? Hey! Hey, Tang Yi! Uh, uh, hey! <laughs> Tang Yi! Take your bath! Uh, no! Come on! No. Take your bath! Uh, I won't! Huh? Why not? No, I'm not used to bathing without this. Oh, it doesn't matter at all, although you shouldn't act like a woman. Huh? I'm not a woman. Oh, oh, oh. I see, I see. Hey, look there. There's a woman over there. You see huh? her? Huh? Where? Hey, 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 where is she? Hmm. Oh, have you seen Tang Ying around? Who, oh, me? Oh, he carried a bucket to bath himself in his tin. Oh? Why doesn't he take a bath in here with you? Me? <laughs> he always takes a bucket of water back to his tent. I don't know why he should, though. man is he? He's even smuggled a girl into his tent. Tai Yang? Tang Ying? General. Oh. oh. Marshal Tang Ying. He... You cannot intrude into other men's business. Yes, sir. When they heard that I was heading towards the city, they opened the gate and surrendered. <laughs> That's because your name is so famous. They knew very well they were no match for your cunning princess. Uh. <laughs> How dare you say I'm cunning? Go to hell! <laughs> <laughs> No, 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 no. Princess not coming, but intelligent. Intelligent. She is intelligent. Uh. 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 You're all talking a load of nonsense. <laughs> and you're talking a load of nonsense. <laughs> The king. The king. Yes, I know. The Chinese fleet is in the harbor, but where is father? Oh, well, 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 you yeah, see, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
try to make trouble? Now listen, you. I am your mistress. <laughs> what do you mean? You're just a girl with no hair. <laughs> I am a royal princess of the kingdom of Anam. And I've come to kill Chen Ho. <laughs> 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 You're not a nun, and yet you shave off all your hair. Does it get too dirty? It is the mark of imperial distinction. <laughs> you're not bad looking, but I'm afraid since you have no hair, you're not very attractive. I do not care. Oh, really? I think it's sexy, though. You're making fun of me. I'm going to teach you a lesson. Ha! Hey, hey. Ha! Are you scared of me? <laughs> I never fought women. What? You look down on me. Who are you? <laughs> I'm one of Marshal Chen's men. I'm Commander Lee. There's no point fighting me. <laughs> I don't care who you are. You don't frighten me. If you beat me, I'm yours to command. Good. I'll make you my wife. You go to hell. <laughs> 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 Because I like you so. Why do you like me? <laughs> I am in love. Huh. You'd like any girl. Oh, this is the first time in my life I've fallen in love. You're lying to me. Don't use secret weapons. Stop butting in. Nobody's unbeatable. Why not stop your daydreaming? You're not the best. I'm not going to listen to you. Marshal, daughter, how could you be so rude to them? You arrived just in time. Now please take the princess back to the palace with you. Ah, oh, you've been most courteous to us. Let's see, thank you to the marshal. Don't be so naughty. Princess, a soldier behaves the same in victory and defeat. Oh, now I understand. She's always promised if anyone ever defeated her, uh, she would have to marry that person. Aren't I right, daughter? Aren't I right? Hmm? <laughs> Marshal, you should be the one to marry her. 
I'm afraid my deepest regret is I can never marry. Uh, excuse me, Marshal. The one who defeated her is over there. <laughs> All right, you're a good man. You must stay here with me and look after my daughter as my new son-in-law. Uh, 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 me? Uh, I, uh, uh, I can't. Huh? Why not? Now I, tell me. I, uh, 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 oh, I am already married. Huh? Uh, But one man can always take many wives. I... I... I just can't. All right. Don't pretend anymore. Uh, I'd accept her if I were you. No, I... Don't force anyone if they are not really willing. <sighs> Father? Huh? He is the one who defeated me. <laughs> oh! Oh, it was General Lee, was it? Uh, uh, no, 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 I didn't. Uh -huh. uh, uh, yeah, yes, 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 I did hold on to her. No, 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 she held on to me. Uh -huh. He's a good man, too. Right, it's settled. You will become my son-in-law. Uh, me. Only one place is home, but it's always pleasant meeting a countryman, because that's like home too. <laughs> I am so glad. And just where are you from? Uh, my name is Wang, born in Canton. I'm a merchant by trade, but the power of Chen Chu Yi is in these parts. Then, just a few days ago, my last two ships were attacked and sunk. Chan Chu Yi is a pirate. I've heard of him before. Do you know where he is? He has such powerful kung fu, and he keeps moving his base. I'll get him, don't you worry. You may leave now. Uh, I've, I've something else. Go ahead, then. Uh, Is it safe to talk here? Of course it is. We are all fellow countrymen. Now what is it? From what people tell me about your journey, it's to track down Emperor Chen Wen and kill him. You shouldn't believe such rumors. True, we are looking for Emperor Chen Wen, but not to capture him. Then you would be interested in knowing where he is. Of course. I have heard that he is in Siam and that he is plotting to regain the throne. Are you certain that Chen Wen is in Siam? He has many good fighters with him. If you are not careful, they will ambush you on the way. But if you go to the place where the cockfights are, you will catch the traitors unaware. Right. You may leave now. Later, I will reward you. Thanks, Marshal. Did you just lose? Huh? I know. That Marshal Chen has sent a mission to Siam to find Emperor Chen Wen. His real aim when he finds him is to kill him. 
And he's to make contact with some people at the cockfight. Y you? No. Don't say anything. I've something to ask. I've been looking for a man I meant to contact. If you can help me, I can give you a reward. Hmm. You've asked the right man. I know everyone who comes here, and they're a strange lot, too. Then do you know where we can find a Chen Wen? Uh... You're going to tell me? Uh, patient. Don't get excited. If you want to find Emperor Chen Wen, go to Plum Court and ask for Lady Peacock. Oh. you better leave here right away. No way the two of you can fight them alone. If we were scared, we wouldn't have come. <laughs> that guy looks rather strange. Do you think he's the Emperor Chen Wen? If a general's unable to be sure, and I'm only a commander, how can I know? getting completely drunk today. You're not going to get drunk so easily. A girl with me makes me very drunk. <laughs> you seem to have lost control just because you have a girl with you. That's why I said I'll drink, Brother Ma. Cheer up. Why not let your hair down for a change? Huh? <laughs> I warn you, don't lose control. Ah, it's a marvelous feeling to hold a young girl. You're red-blooded. What's wrong with you? Why shy with the girls? You can't have any heart. Insult me. So what if I do? You're dumb. You're dumb. You. Uh -uh. Come on. You lost against me last time. You want to try again? OK. Now, there's no need to fight, gentlemen. Lady Anne, you be the judge. We'll see who's stronger. <laughs> Don't try pulling any tricks this time. Stop making excuses. <laughs> <laughs>
please join us. Some wine? Do you gentlemen know who I am? Lady Peacock. I do not join customers for a drink. I know very well you don't. But please, join us for a while. Have you two come here for an evening's entertainment? Yes, we have. That is, we really came here to see you. <laughs> I think you've got the wrong girl. <laughs> no, we haven't. This gentleman is far too proud. Not only that, he's a playboy and chases girls. We have so many girls here. Why do you want to choose me? Because <laughs> I like you. <laughs> I don't think that's the real reason. <laughs> what else could we have possibly come to this place for? If we're going to talk, you must level with me. I want you to help me locate a man. What man? Emperor Chen Wen. <gasps> Emperor Chen Wen? What's he emperor of? Never heard of him. Huh. We may as well speak frankly to you. We're in a position to offer you a lot of money. Oh. Uh. Oh, <laughs> all right. We'll regard each other as friends. I'll tell you where he is. Majesty, I'm General Mar. Commander Teng Xing. Your, Your Majesty. Majesty. Long, long live, live, long live, live long, long live, live the, the king. king. Get out of here. No need to be angry. We've come on a long journey just to see Your Majesty. We only want to talk. I'm very contented living here, and I don't want to leave. Your visits disturbed me, my calm shattered. Your Majesty, don't you miss your own home? Don't you want to leave this place? I was defeated in battle. Now I have retired. Emperor Yen wants you back. He's ready to give you the throne if you return with us. Huh? Just a trick. Your Majesty. Your Majesty. Your Majesty. Oh. <laughs> 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 Understand. Please, Your Majesty, please allow the Marshal to explain. All right. I would like to know the real reason for Chen Ho visiting me. Thank you, Your Majesty. Do you think that man is the real Emperor Chen Wen or a fake? 
I didn't notice. But even if he's not, you wouldn't be able to tell. Do you think you know him that well? Yes, I do. I've seen the Emperor. Oh. Where have you seen him? Oh. Uh, well, the Chief Marshal showed me a good picture of him in his tent. At least the Chief Marshal should know. Hmm. Didn't I say before? You'd be a burden. Get up. If you hadn't had my help here, you would have been beaten. You could be right. Oh. Come on. I'll carry you. Mm. Uh. Can you keep it up? Uh, it's always better to have two heads than one. Agreed. I'm being a burden. Don't mention it anymore. Only now do I find you're a good man. I've always been a good guy. You didn't notice. Except you don't have a wife. Oh, but who would want to marry a soldier? You're not just a soldier. You're a general. Oh? Huh? Why don't you marry me? Me? <laughs> don't get the wrong idea. I'm a man. If only you were a girl. I think you'd make an excellent wife. <laughs> you like my character? Yes, I do. I'm myself fortunate to have got to know you as well as this. Well, well, don't give up. I do have a sister. Oh? Is she married? Of course not. She's much too young. Would I be good enough, do you think? Well, you seem to have made up your own mind on the subject, haven't you? I want to go back to China now. Then I'll go around to see her sister right away. Oh, look at you like a little boy who's got a new toy. I don't know your sister. I'm so excited. Just that I think I'm interested. Well, I could say you're not very intelligent. You're dumb. Oh, huh? if you insult me, I won't carry you. Oh, don't miss the chance to carry me now. Oh, 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 all right, all right. You're like my baby now. And if I drop you, I'll be a bachelor the rest of my life. Oh, shut up. Let's get back. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> oh. That woman does know all the tricks. Long live, long live your majesty. How dare you all come here to see me? You want to kill me? Your Majesty, I have come here to invite you to return to your country. Hmm. You're all traitors, all of you. Your real purpose is to kill me. You can go back and tell Yen I will return, but it will be on my own, and to kill him. There is no need for two brothers to have to start killing each other. From what I know, Emperor Yen feels kindly towards you. He won't play any tricks. What do you mean? Just as I thought, you are not the Emperor. Hmm. Huh? He's the man who was at the cockfight. Hey! <laughs> 
I must thank you for sparing my life. In return, I will tell you where to find the real emperor. Where is he now? He is at a temple, as a monk. He's a monk? Does anyone else know that? One of the other monks told me this. He told me to keep it quiet, so we all protect him. And see that he's not disturbed. He's leading a life of God. Tell us where to find the temple. It's in the Haluba Mountains. You have to pass through bandit country. We need to destroy the gang entirely. But we can't use an invading army. Tang Ying. Better spread out and go to the temple and find the Emperor straight away. Yes, sir. Marshal, it will be dangerous for him alone. I think you better send someone else along, just in case. General, I thought you said he was a burden. Oh, oh. we've now become inseparable companions. <laughs> I think you two get on well together. Thank you, Chief Marshal. Huh? What did you say? Uh, uh, I said I want to thank you, Marshal, giving us a chance to be together. Huh. You ought to go immediately. Yes, sir. sir. Drink it. Carry him out quickly. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh. Going to the temple. Do we have to cross the river first? Uh, but you must wait half an hour for the boat. Uh, please have some tea first. Uh, drink up. Thank you. Come on. Uh, wait a moment. Let's do some arm wrestling first. All right. Uh, mister, uh, why not have some tea? Uh. Uh. Hold it. Wait a Take away the cups. Uh, why didn't you drink it first? Ah, uh, clear it, clear it. Take it away. Uh, yes, yes. All right. He's not a simple man. He's a very special person. Hey! <laughs> She is much too beautiful. I couldn't fight her. It's my guess. He's finally found out I'm a woman.
Nice to meet you two. Huh? Hmm? You, Lady Peacock. Who are you really? <laughs> I'm the local boss around here. Uh -huh. You run quite a big business. You're right there, it is big. And my master's a very influential man. On land as well as sea. Uh -huh. He has a hand in everything, I'll bet. <laughs> yes, that's right. You must be feeling rather thirsty, aren't you? <laughs> Here. Why not have some tea? Here. Drink. <laughs> Thank uh. you. You can't drink that. Huh? That tea has been poisoned. Nonsense! Who are you? I'm not with you. I work for the Emperor. What do you suggest we do? No trouble now. Let's go. You've come. You must have run fast. Yes, I was in a hurry to get here. Yeah. <laughs> you've ruined all my planning. In fact, you've proved quite useless, aren't I right? I've come a long way to find you, but instead you start quarreling with me. What the hell's got into you? What do you mean? I'm crazy about you. Well, let's go our separate ways. <laughs> if that's what you want, I couldn't give a damn. We just don't get on together. Oh, yeah? My dear princess, there's no need for us to be quarreling like this. What happened? 
I had them in my hand. I was just about to kill them. Suddenly, somebody came out and started fighting. He ruined everything. Who was it? I don't know him. That's all right. Now, there are many monks in the temple. Even though we don't know yet which is Emperor Chen Wen. Now they're going to meet him. All we have to do is follow them and wait until the moment is right. Right. Hey, that's a good idea. We'll let them do all the work and lead us to him. Come on, let's get going. Hold it. I must make some arrangements first. You wait for me here. Mm. Sure, he's emperor? He's the emperor. Huh? Hold it. What are you doing here? I'm bodyguard Chen Wen. Majesty, I'm Chan Ho. You must return. I am a monk now. I am no longer the Emperor. Your Majesty, Emperor Yan has ordered us to try and find you, and once we had found you, we were to beg you to consider your duty to your own country. All human beings, Whatever their station, whether they're rich or poor, are equal in the sight of God. No matter what happens, disaster, disease, no one can avoid it. We are all God's children, and nobody has any dominion. I have become a monk. My past life is all behind me, so please don't disturb me. Would his name be praised? <sighs> I've been expecting you. I'm glad you could oblige. <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> Get him! Don't go that way. Let's split up. Come on. Yeah! <laughs> 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 
Lucky our chief marshal is a man of mercy. He'll just warn you instead of killing you, so you'd be wise to surrender. Where's the emperor? Speak up. If you tell me where the emperor is, I will spare your life. Uh, uh, uh. Thank you for being kind to me, but the emperor's been kidnapped by the bandit chief. Do you mean Chan Chu Yi? Marshal, I will take you there if you like. As you've confessed, I'll forgive you. Get up now. What's the matter? Master, the chief marshal is coming. <laughs> you better hide yourself quick.
the Emperor. Look there. Huh? Can't you ye? Huh. You must all leave Siam immediately. Otherwise, I'm gonna kill him. Majesty. Please go. Go back home. I've given my life to God. I've no memory of the past. Your Majesty. Majesty, I've come such a long way, and now I've finally found you. But you refuse to talk to your wife. Huh? She's a queen. Ah. Glory be. I would never have guessed that it could have been her. She is the wife of Emperor Chen Wen. She's the Empress. Kuai, go back now. Forget the past. Your Highness, please, please you forgive, must us. forgive me. You get up now. You give great strength to your country. You must continue on your journey and spread the word of China's greatness. Yes, Your Highness. General. Tang Hing. No, 